kører den der bare, så kører du den opad. Vi startede. Vi startede ved 0 herovre, ja. så kørte den der herovre. So today in the workshop we've been working partly on the BPM2 engine. So this engine is a very very crude engine. It doesn't have a throat as you see. So the whole purpose of this very crude engine is to evaluate uh, our fuel and mixture ratios of the fuel. As you know the ethanol is uh, is uh, thinned with water and we want to minimize the amount of water that we use. So we'll make a lot of experiments on that and for that purpose this very very crude engine uh, is very suited. Because if we uh, if it burns through, then uh, it's very easy to to make anyone. The Indian pipe itself is just a, a pipe with a flange on it. And to that flange, we'll then hook a, the lock stone, which looks like this. So liquid oxygen will go in through this hole. And then we have some pressure measurement ports, various places. And inside this dome will fit the injector. And the injector is still fitted here in the milling machine, because we're still working on it. So what you see here on top, that's the, uh, the lock's entrance side. So this one will fit down into the lock stone like this and so locks will pour through these holes and then on the other side we have 28 injector channels which will then uh, distribute the, the fuel both the locks and the ethanol into the uh, into the engine tube so uh, today we've been milling these parts and on this machine it has a digital readout so we, uh, it's, it's quite easy, it's not exactly a CNC machine. Uh, but we're using this uh, circular divider head to, uh, to lay out the, uh, the holes, uh, especially because now we're going to turn it upside down, or we're going to turn it 90 degrees to make the, uh, the fuel holes that go in uh, regularly. And that's the, uh, the next step that we'll do in a few minutes. And so one of the purposes of this BPM2 engine is to investigate the, uh, the, fuel uh, the fuel mixture ratio. We put water in it to decrease the combustion temperature and to make the, the engine not melt. So in these experiments we'll replace the water with tears and maybe we can go to a very very small percentage, around 1% of the fuel can be tears. And when it burns, then it forms a silicon oxide layer on the inside of the tube, which minimizes heat transfer to the tube itself. And so this project, the BPM2 project, is really an investigation that runs prior to running the BPM5 engine, because we don't want to trash a BPM5 engine on this kind of test. But you can see the BPM2 engine is, is very easy to re replace. So we run all these tests on BPM2 engines, and then when we got a good result, then we will uh, scale it up to the BPM5 engine. <laughs> 